Okay, I'm back. My memory card filled up. You know, it wouldn't be a Carla video without stopping and starting a zillion times. So, I have some more stamps to share. And again, I was looking for bargains. I found this one. It was a dollar. And I thought it was really, really cute. It was one of the gelatins. And um, I really liked it for the little bunny. It's an Easter stamp. So, I got that. Can you see? Ooh, some weird lighting going on here. So, I got that one. Again, it was a dollar. I had to get this one because it's cute little kitty cats. And we have three little kittens. And it says Catitude. And then in the back is a bunch of other Inka Dinka Doo kitty cat type stamp. And again, it was a dollar. I got that. And I picked this one up. This is a Bow Bunny um, Clearly Calendar stamp set. It was a dollar. This is from 2009, way back when, before the Filofax and planning craze began. But I got it. Because I thought it was really, really cute. Ooh, look at the weird lighting. Um, but it's, you know, they're scaled to calendar pages. And it says, game night, lessons, anniversary. And there's little icons to go with them all. I actually got it for Carly because she does planners and stuff with her school and all her volunteering and stuff. She won't use the crop night so much, but she'll use some of the others. I got that. And then in this one, it was $2.00. And I always like to get sentiments. There's a whole bunch of other jumbled things. Marilyn was trying to help me unjumble them, and I'm not going to do it right now. It's a whole mess of stuff in here. i got to mess with numbers, and I think it was calendar pieces. So I got that a mess. I won't even look at that right now. But I got, that, got this one because I love the fonts and the sentiments on these. It says, girl stuff, boy stuff, secrets. One of a kind, favorite things. And I thought this with me doing some of the pocket pages and stuff would be kind of fun. Treasures of the heart, happy, delight, remember, celebrate, simply the best. So I thought there were some good sentiments. I got those. And I'm not sure what manufacturer these are. They're like the, this teal blue color. This says your special day, birthday wishes, happy birthday, celebrate, make a wish, and the candles. But what I really, really loved were the number candles. Um, I thought they were really, really cute. And every year when Carly was little, I used to buy her these candles with, you know, like this. So these were adorable. And this was, how much did I say? Two dollars. Couldn't pass that up. So that came home with me. Um, just a few more things to share. I picked these little pack of gel pens. They were a dollar for Carly. She loves anything office supplies. And then by the front door while we were waiting in line, because it was a long line, I was looking in the boxes and Marilyn's like, nope, just stop looking, stop looking, because she knew I was on a budget. Um, and I found these little chipboard albums. She's like, just get one, just get one. I said, no two, no two. Ended up getting two. This is Fab Scraps. Um, they're little um, chipboard albums. They're like laser cut. And it was $3, but look at that. How cute is that? There, look at all the detail for $3. So it's a little chipboard album. And then I got this one. It's a gatefold with the birdhouse and there's a little bird inside and it comes with the ring. I thought that was really cute and I love doing mini albums and for three dollars you won't find this type of a cut for that price at a regular you know box store. Um, then I just have a few more things to share with you. Um, I got my first Magnolia stamp thanks to Marilyn. Um, she helped me pick a few out and they do not put names on here. They were each five dollars and then I bought my first Magnolia doohickey dot. I got the border one. Um, it was $10. Marilyn got the same one. I think she paid 8 or 9 Because, you know, they're all priced different. Um, so I got that one. It's like a little lacy border or a little frilly border. And then I have, I'm not sure if you'll be able to see them because the lighting's getting really stinky. This is little Magnolia. And it looks like she's, if she could see her. Ooh, look at the lighting. Um, she's got hearts that she's catching or throwing up in the air. I'm not sure because it's hard to tell because there's nothing on the background as, on the back as a reference. But I thought she was cute. And they had oodles and oodles and oodles of these stamps. Um, and then this one, she's carrying something but she's sitting down. And she was cute. And you know, Marilyn does not like her, her um, magnolia stamps to show their feet and I agree with her on that one so I think all of mine are wearing shoes and then this one I thought was absolutely adorable she's like dressed up but she has a big heart 
on a stick, like a cane. And then she has like, um, you know, at 4th of July or whatever, you have the little headband with stars or something. She has two little hearts, like little wiggly hearts on her head. And she's just really cute. I know they don't have little mouths, but I'll get past that. So I got my first little magnolia. Thanks to Marilyn. The enabler. Um, now the last thing I got. Hmm, let me see what the best way to do this. It's a big old box. There are some dies in there that I haven't shown you. And a whole bunch of punches. Yep. I love punches. I still use my punches. And I scored. And some of you might say, oh, they take up a lot of space. Oh, they're heavy. But, um. I love them because they're easy and I can use up my scraps. But I'm going to pull out these guys that I threw in here. Um, and I'll try to get through these really, really fast because I've already filled up one memory card with this from Chit Chatting. A lot of these were a dollar or 50 cents. But it, I got this little dove. If you can even see it. There you go. I got a cat. Because we have three little kittens. An ornament. A butterfly. This one was 50 cents. And I love these old dies. This one is a series of hearts. Might be easier for me to show you the back. That was 50 cents. 50 cents! And there were tons of these. Tons! So I'm just going to start pulling out some of these punches because I bought a boatload of them. Um, I guess I'll show you the Martha Stewart ones if I can dig them all out. I think these are the only two Martha Stewart. I got this bird one that was $3. I got this heart one. This one was six. This one was a little pricier, but I thought it was well worth it for the size. And uh, I thought it would go cute with some of those tilde um, stamps that I got. Kind of had a tilde like look to it to me. So I got that. And then the rest of them were super de duper, cuckoo crazy cheap for punches. And I had even more, but I was really good. And I can't even tell you, I may have gotten a repeat in here, I'm not sure. I don't have any of these already. But, like I said, for the price of these, I'm going to have to move faster. Yeah, that's not all of them, guys. And they're humongous. And I don't care, because I love punches. And some of these punches are very expensive when they were first purchased. And if for some reason, look, there's another die. It's another heart. It's a double heart. And that was a dollar. Okay, here's the last punch in the box. And I had to love this big old box around. So, let's see. Alright. This is a bag of punches because I'm always making um, like homemade flowers and stuff and cards and stuff. This was $8. You got four punches, but they're leaves. And I didn't have this one. And I like the little spray one. I have a holly, but this one's a little bit different. And I have some similar to this, but I really liked it. So they're basically $2 a piece. So, then these were 50 cents. And it's like a little postage stamp. This one is one and a quarter. Again, 50 cents. This one is... Okay, oh, it stopped again. This one is one and a quarter, but it's scalloped. I got that one. Um, 50 cents. This one is a little bit larger. It's one and nine sixteenths. 50 cents. This one is a postage. One and nine sixteenths. Let me show it to you. 50 cents. So those four. Then I got this one, which is similar to the other one that I got, but it's a little bit bigger. I couldn't measure it, so I didn't have a ruler with me, but I could just eyeball it and see that it was a little bit bigger. 50 cents. This one's even a little bit bigger for making cards and, you know, whatnot, tags or whatever. 50 cents. This one is marked Tangle. This one was marked 75 cents. Not sure why. I think it's the same seller, but 75 cents. Here's the oval scalloped, 50 cents. And there were more of these guys. I think this lady had like every one you can imagine. Here's a big leaf. Thought that one was really cute. This one was a dollar fifty. There's a little bit more. Another leaf, because I like using these on my 
um, cards when I'm building a scene or like a little floral spray. A dollar. Um, a rectangle square. I mean, you know, straight, not scalped. Fifty cents. Really nice for doing labels and stuff. There's another. Now this one had a little bit different scallop lines than the other one. It's a little tighter. Fifty cents. And this is a bigger scalloped one. Seventy-five cents. And this one, look how big the circle one is. I can almost use some of those smaller image stamps in this one. Seventy-five cents. It's a larger square. Scalloped. Fifty cents. A larger rectangle. Dollar fifty. And my last punch were some photo corners. A dollar. A dollar, dollar, dollar. So that is everything that I picked up at this year's scrapbook yard sale at Betty's store. We had a blast. Um, we did some major damage. We had a great time and I found some really great deals. Can't get over these for 50 cents. Love, love, love. So, hope you guys are all having a wonder, wonderful Monday and I'm going to get all these little clips that I shot because you know, that's the way it always happens for me. You guys all have a wonderful week and I should have um, another video coming up. I have some goodies. Marilyn spoiled me again that I have to show you guys. So let me put all this away and I'll come back in a few minutes and share with you the little goodies that she gave me. Bye guys.